For over a century, Clearfield Hospital has enjoyed a strong relationship with our community, built upon trust, commitment, and quality service. We are constantly improving our facilities and acquiring new technologies to keep pace with the advances in healthcare. Because of the breadth of medicine that we practice, you will practice everything that you learned in training, and I think patients here are truly appreciative of the services that they receive. At the we, hospital we have a full uh, pulmonary function lab. In the radiology department we have probably the, the latest CT scanner that's out on the market. So, you know, even though we're a, a small hospital, we, you know, we're not lagging behind in, in any respect with technology. We have a, uh, a stable and uh, committed staff of uh, over 600 staff members. in my uh, residency at Bethesda Naval Hospital in Washington, D.C. Uh, at the completion of my Navy obligation, I was looking for a uh, place to raise a family and come to practice, and I was looking for a place where I could personally make a difference. I looked at uh, eight places in central Pennsylvania, uh, and uh, I picked Clearfield. We have an actually very strong medical staff, and you can't say that everywhere in, in rural America. I, I really, truly believe that. In 1993, two years after I arrived in uh, Clearfield, I went to my 10-year uh, medical school reunion and my classmates were asking me what was I doing in Clearfield. First of all, they didn't know where Clearfield was. I had to explain to them where Clearfield was and they, they asked me, what are you doing there, Tom? And I told them I'm making a difference. This is Progressive Rural Healthcare. I'm Bob Murray, I'm the President and CEO of the Clearfield Hospital, and I'd like to acquaint you with our hospital and our mission statement here, which is, in essence, friends and neighbors taking care of friends and neighbors. We are a small community hospital located in north central Pennsylvania, but we've got an awful lot to offer here. We have a service area that uh, consists of approximately 75,000 people, and we have a uh, considerable uh, number of practices here for a small community hospital. We like to keep it that way. We've got fairly selective medical staff and um, we work very well with the nurses. We have a, a very good group of nurses that really care about the patients and there's really not a lot of uh, friction because in a small town there really can't be otherwise uh, things don't get, get you know things don't happen and in a hospital that can't be the situation. So we work very well together and we uh, function together to take care of our patients. The patient that comes in is our sister laying in that bed. It's our sister, it's our daughter, and uh, we treat them like that. And the difference between the, a, like a small town practice and a larger metropolitan practice, maybe in a larger metropolitan practice you'll be pigeonholed into either a lower socioeconomic or middle class or higher, where in a small town you'll get the, the whole breadth of uh, patients. The major thrust of why it's good to practice in Clearfield, specifically here at the hospital, is that number one, you personally can make a difference. And if you're a good physician and a capable physician, the community will give back to you more than you, could, you ever could, could give to them. We take care of our neighbors and literally, in the 15 years I've been here, I have delivered my neighbors. <laughs> and uh, that's, a special, that's a special thing. And I don't think in a lot of communities you can get that. Families know one another. My patients oftentimes know one another. And I think that's a good thing because there's a strong community support system. Patients here actually thank us for, you know, helping them and taking care of them and uh, lots of times going out of our way to, to do it and that's what we became doctors for, to help people. You know, it, it's nice to be able to send somebody to x-ray right across the parking lot during the day and have my result immediately and, and all of those kinds of things that are easily facilitated. We have an excellent staff of therapists in our rehab center. The department itself is located within the hospital on the second floor directly across the street from the Clearfield Professional Group. And what's different about our department compared to any other one that you will see is that we actually have all of our rehabs combined into one wing. We have inpatient and outpatient physical therapy, inpatient and outpatient occupational therapy, inpatient and outpatient speech therapy, and then we also have outpatient cardiac rehab and the Better Breathing Center, which is our outpatient pulmonary rehab program. We're offering a wide range of uh, services here that uh, you don't typically see at a, at a small community hospital. We just recently opened our own uh, comprehensive cancer center. Uh, we have a, already had a very large uh, chemotherapy program and now we're offering the uh, radiation oncology. 
Our facility is brand new. We have um, state-of-the-art equipment here, including an on-site pharmacy. We have eight treatment areas and we give state-of-the-art cancer treatment for patients who need chemotherapy or any other needs that they might require during their uh, illnesses. We have a new state-of-the-art linear accelerator in the cancer center here, offering treatment for patients requiring radiation treatments as well. We've renovated our uh, obstetrics unit to uh, make our birthing experiences here a little more family friendly. Uh, we're initiating a new uh, cath lab for diagnostic uh, low-risk catheterizations and uh, offering a, a wide variety of uh, surgical procedures here that uh, you often don't find in, in a small community hospital. When you consider where to practice medicine, I don't want you to, to think that you're going to undersell a rural practice because a rural practice can give you so much more than, than you'll ever, ever expect and, and the people could be so much more appreciative.